hello everyone in this video we are going to see how to fix this error which is a uh, that occurring when we are hosting our cock igniter website so here you can see the error is return type of c i session file driver should either be compatible with the session handler interface open Oh, attribute should be used temporarily suppress the notice so uh, here what I will go ahead and do to avoid this error is just open my file explorer or just the your FTP manager and then here you have to go to the root path of your web page it might be just a uh, public HTML like that okay now I'm just going to my public HTML you don't have to do anything just go to the public HTML and then you will see some uh, folder called system go to there and inside that you will see this uh, libraries folder this one and inside this you will see this sessions folder now go to the drivers folder and finally you will see this session underscore file driver dot uh, php like that and then all you had to do just go ahead and download that and after downloading that you can open that file now if you want to see where is your file is downloaded you can click the download again and this will show your target destination this this is the place that your file will be stored so open that file using visual studio code here this one okay and after opening that we are the visual studio code uh, open your browser again here you will see this line number one after this drivers for slash sessions underscore files driver dot php here this is the line number 132 so go to that line number here and after that make sure you are going to uh, edit a bow of this public function and function name each and every time you have to add this code in the above and then here in the web page you will see this hash square brackets inside that for uh, backslash return type will change you had to copy this code hash square brackets inside that backslash return type will change now paste that here and then again if you go to the down in the web page you will see this 294 go to there and then above this function you have to paste that code again and let me go ahead and open the web page again 168 go to that line number this one you have to paste that here okay and then uh, 237 okay here above this function and now 317 this one it doesn't matter whether it shows the line number as 317 but the thing is you have to add this code in above of this uh, function name because inside comments you cannot code you cannot paste codes that's why I'm telling you to add the code in above of these functions names function declarations and then here you will see this shows at the code in the line number to 317 and, and that means in the same number so we don't have to do that so here 358 now if we go 
here we have to add this in above this function name and after that 282 here we are going back that means you can see this code is added already that means if you are seeing more errors that doesn't mean you have to add the code again because you already added that code each and every place if you seeking this code is already added that uh, showing in this line number okay now all you have to do just save this file and then just upload into the same location that you downloaded in your server so I'm going to just drag this file into here and then click OK and after that I'm going to just refresh this yeah, you can see the error is gone okay I hope this video helps if this helps please subscribe thank you